Experiments on animals are done to find out the effect of a particular drug or exposure on a living organism. On the one hand, it is inhuman to them, they cannot give their consent, tell their pain and stop if they do not like it. On the other hand, many sciences, including surgery, pharmaceutics, cosmetology and others, would practically halt their development if experiments on animals were to stop. The first experiments on animals are mentioned in history already in the 4 to 3 centuries BC, they were performed by doctors in order to practice surgical skills and expand knowledge about living organisms, mainly goats and pigs were used. In the 19th century AD mass experiments on animals were also carried out by medics, they purposefully infected animals with diseases to find out their specific course, studied reflexes, tested antibiotics and drugs created on them, and tested cloning and gene modifications. In the 20th century, testing drugs for toxicity became mandatory because their side effects often exceeded the harm from the disease for which they were created. Testing also began using animals, including pregnant women. In the same century, experiments on animals went beyond medicine, for example, they were the first to conquer the spaces of space, as well as supporters of behaviorism and other psychologists experimented on animals to find out their behavioral reactions. Today, scientists are creating cures for many diseases, including those previously thought to be fatal and incurable. Experiments on animals in this system are unavoidable, because otherwise it is impossible to test the effectiveness and side effects of drugs. According to statistics, over 1 million vertebrates are experimented on each year. The number of invertebrates is many times greater and is not counted. Pros of Animal Experimentation This makes it possible to test the effects of any exposure or substance on any organism. There are many branches of science that involve the creation of any drugs for the treatment of any disease. It is not possible to test their effects on humans, no human being would agree to perform experiments on himself, the result of which is unpredictable. Sometimes it is also necessary to identify the peculiarities of the psyche, behavior, instincts and reflexes. A human being is a conscious creature, so experiments of this kind can be distorted by the human factor. Humans are not at risk. A drug that has not been tested on animals can have undesirable effects on the human body, up to and including death. Science believes that the life of a lab rat is worth many times less than a human life. And they are more likely to be right than not. Accurate results. Experiments on animals most often give a fairly accurate picture of what is going on. No amount of calculation, Testing on artificial materials and plants can show as accurate a result as animals. Laboratory animals, on which experiments are conducted, are fairly rapidly reproducing creatures. That is, material for experiments is quickly replenished, there is no need to spend large sums of money to acquire them. If there is a need to acquire them, it is also quite easy to find such animals. Medical students at universities and colleges need to acquire knowledge and practical skills. It is hard to imagine that a future surgeon would perform his very first surgery on a human, the probability of a lethal outcome is almost 100%. Therefore, future doctors should have the opportunity to experiment and improve their skills on animals. Impunity Animals cannot complain to the police or the court because a human has deprived them of sight or infected them with an incurable disease. No one will punish scientists who conduct experiments on animals as part of a lab. The Cons of Experimenting on Animals Inhumane Treatment of Animals They can't give their consent to procedures and experiments, they can't refuse them. They have no way to stop the experience if they don't like it. Even if they cry out in pain or discomfort, no one can help them, humans have other tasks. High Errors in the Results of the Experiment Although humans and rats are mammals, they are very different. Based on the size of the animal, it is quite difficult to choose the right dosage for a human. It is also impossible to know exactly how a substance will affect a human, even if it has been tested on an animal, for example, Oral contraceptives thin the blood in dogs and sometimes lead to blood clots in women. 
That is, sometimes the effects of a drug on an animal and a human can be diametrically opposed. It is almost impossible to detect the effects of drugs on some mental processes. If a rat goes blind after a drug, it can be seen, but it cannot tell about its internal sensations, for example, if hallucinations develop against the background of the drug, it will be possible to find out only if the drug is taken by a human. A large number of laboratory animals are usually needed for experiments. Despite the fact that they themselves are quite common biomaterial, there are still costs for them, this includes food and certain conditions of confinement in order to get the most clear and accurate results of the experiments. After the experiments, the animals, if they did not die during the experiment, are artificially put to death. It turns out that the life of these living beings depends entirely on man, he decides what purpose the creature has, what it will do, and even how long it will live. Conclusions Experimentation on animals is very inhumane and cruel. Without such experiments, it would be virtually impossible to find cures and treatments for cancer, AIDS and other serious, as yet incurable diseases. In addition, without experiments involving animals, humanity would probably still be unaware of the peculiarities of psyche and behavior. Let us know what you think about experimentation on animals in the comments below. If you liked this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Otherwise, have a great day. Thanks for watching.